I overheard a couple planning an upcoming visit to Goldpan the other day. Why should the youth of our county feel compelled to spend their leisure time visiting a glorified petrol station? Economic hardship or sheer stupidity? Call in to cast your vote. Some sad news today as local sports hero Morris Bunyan announced his retirement from the Two Point Oinks. The Hog Hurling League just won't be the same without him. What? <laughs> 
reasons, staff are asked to try their best. This advertisement has been removed due to a dispute between Two Point Radio and the producer of Jumbo Nuts. Oh wait, hang on, it shouldn't actually say Jumbo Nuts. Can we do another, can we do another take? Okay, great. This is Two Point Radio.
Jumbo has done it again. This week sees the release of their latest product, the self-watching TV. Now you can leave your home safe in the knowledge that all those wonderful Jumbo Channel programs are still being watched. This is Ricky Hawthorne on Two Point Radio. Today's Get Fit with Rick is for all you people who'd rather stay at home and exercise. Now, we've all heard about stationary bikes, but have you tried stationary skateboards? Just don't use one in front of a mirror. It's not a pretty sight.
toilets as you would hope to find them, not as you would expect to find them. Is a good way to stay in shape at home. Stationary swimming. I know what you're thinking, but this isn't about splashing about in a half-filled bathtub. That'd be silly. No, you should use an inflatable paddling pool. See how many lumps you can do. Stop it. 
visiting the hospital. Mortimer, Mortimer, you've just won another Grand Point final. How do you do it? Well, I couldn't do it without my cheesy gubbins. Cheesy gubbins. Cheesy gubbins, the answer to every question. More Two Point, more often. This is Two Point Radio. To your roofs and windows, listeners, and turn your attention to the south, where space rocks are raining down from the sky. A beautiful, peaceful sight. Unless they're raining down on you, I'd imagine. Oh, well, you win some, you lose some.
calling nurse. End of year approaching. Now, if you like your sports to be a little more extreme, I've got two words for you. Stationary bungee jumping. That's three words, but that's just how extreme it is. All you need is a piece of string and a chair. And if that doesn't get your heart racing, I don't know what will.
And I leave you with another inspirational quote from our nice words of the day segment. When life hands you lemons, squeeze them and squirt the citric acid right into life's eyes. So long, dear listeners. Nigel Bickleworth on Two Point Radio. Fear not, faithful listeners. Your favorite radio personality, Sir Nigel Bickleworth, is back. As much as I would like to quit this infernal booth forever, I just cannot deprive you of my wit. I take the responsibility of being your only source of intellectual stimulation very seriously indeed. More instantly forgettable melodies coming up next.
delighted to say I will be giving a lecture at our local university on the topic of pretentiousness, namely how to do it correctly. Perhaps my contribution will put a halt to the alarming decline in educational standards in our community. I've always said electricity was a bad thing. To all those who scoffed at me, spare the thought for the poor souls in a hospital currently under siege from an electrical storm.
10 milligrams of something. It's back to med school for the senior doctor who's forgotten everything he knows. I don't know what to do. He wants to learn medicine. I'm a boss. But he needs to learn about himself. Dad! Roderick Cushion is Dr. Roderick Cushion in Backwards, the show that everybody's hearing about. New episodes every week on Bungle Pictures. More Two Point. More often. This is Two Point Radio.
What a shame that mineral clusters of such great scientific intrigue would fall into an area from which no one will bother to fetch them. Improve your aim if you want us to better understand you, O oh celestial heavens above. to Nigel Bickleworth <laughs> on Two Point Radio. The Orb Foundation's healthcare division is nothing but a load of hocus-pocus hogwash, if you ask me. It doesn't take a brain surgeon to see the only thing they're good at is brainwashing.
ますAnd now for Sir Nigel Reviews, in which Sir Nigel reviews the new fitness center in Lower Bullocks, the Steel Buns Gym. I spent a very pleasant afternoon in the sauna, but did not care for the smells as one walks down the corridor. In short, I would stick with the perspiration spa in Grockle Bay.
I don't mind telling you it's a bit nippy in the booth today. The heater is malfunctioning, and the window is stuck in an open position. I have no choice but to engage in vigorous exercise. Now, if you'll excuse me. Try Moose Juice, the healthiest drink on the market. Wow! Only the finest organic mousses make it into our juices. Moose Juice. More Two Point, more often. This is Two Point Radio.
I've discovered the heater had been jammed with sodium snacks. No wonder it ceased to function. I suspect this is the work of that unhygienic anarchist, Harrison Wolf. Words will be had, I assure you. and wolf the lone voice of reason ready to spread some truth to all our vigilant listeners so open your eyes and your ears and get ready to find out what's really going on but first here are some people playing musical instruments Please go to marketing. 
I've started exploring past lives. I've tried hypnotizing myself with pendulums and pocket watches, but I find listening to my own voice works best. I say one thing, and then another thing. And I say one thing, and then another thing. It's possible you're now hypnotized too. Nurse required in cardiology. Healthcare branch of the holistics company, known to some as hemp, is in trouble again. Apparently, Elixir, their latest product which claims to cure all ills, is in fact nothing but pine scented prune juice. Well, I guess it should cure one ill at least.
Leave your toilet at home with chocolate spongy cake balls. Made with the most absorbent edible substances that science could find. For the person about town with more liquids than time. Ah, uh, soak it all in. More Two Point, more often. This is Two Point Radio. and Wolf on Two Point Radio. I went to the Cirque de Parfait recently. I was impressed by how experimental the acts were till I realized it was facing the wrong way and just looking at the tent wall.
Therapist says I need to relax more. Find a hobby. If you have any suggestions, please send them in. I'll keep you posted on how my search goes. Anything's better than my last hobby. Collecting traffic cones. Hands lab, please. 
45th caller today will win tickets to the Rock Festival taking place next month. I admire a station manager's optimism. The most callers we've ever had in a day was six. Two of them were wrong numbers. will be asked to stop. The ups. The downs. The potential implications. Come to the Sloop this season and cheer on the team that plays there. Playing the sport that they play. More Two Point. More often. This is Two Point Radio.
Why is it whenever you clip your nails in front of a computer, one of the nails always flies into the cracks of your keyboard? Does the keyboard feed on them? I don't know. No one knows. Undercover journalist approaching the hospital. Hawthorne on Two Point Radio. This is Ricky Hawthorne bringing talk, music, and news to the whole of Two Point County. And if you're listening to us from the newly opened hospital, just turn up that volume because nothing drowns out the sound of sick people like the voice of a world class DJ. Coming up next, 42 hours of music from the background band. Enjoy!
to the pharmacy. I've been humming that tune to myself all week, which is uncanny because I've never heard it before. Or have I? Oh well, more catchy music coming right up. In the news today, conditions at the Rotting Hill Hospital are getting worse every day. Apparently, patients are just as likely to die from sinkholes and crumbling ceilings as any diseases. At least that'll keep the queues down.
Salt levels dangerously low. Eat some briny brittle. The taste of the sea right in your mouth. 24 hours a day. This is Two, two, two Point Radio. Janitor, please prepare research board.
what a smashing day for a bit of gardening. I mean, who doesn't like gardening? Digging up a bit of soil, sticking your hands in a bit of manure. Oh, I can almost smell it now. No, oh, wait, the sewage pipes burst again. <laughs> no, my mistake. Anyway, keep those fingers green. I went to a holistics nature commune last week to see what they could do about my gravy allergy. They recommended a long stay at their spa and a bottle of rosemary extract. It cost me a month's wages, but I'm finally starting to feel the effects. Still can't eat gravy though. Research. 
cardiology. We're getting news of a rather sizable earthquake hitting one of our hospitals. If you're there now, try not to fall into any holes and stay away from any cracks in the walls. Oh, and have a listen to this lovely song. It'll calm you right down.
I tell you what I've been enjoying recently. The scribblings of one Ms. Charlatine Fishwrapper over at the Two Point Squabbler. Finally, someone writing in a fashion that I can understand. I particularly enjoyed her piece, Seven Ways to Get the Most Out of Your Coat. Now that was high quality wordsmithery.
toilets as you would hope to find them, not as you would expect to find them. to your roofs and windows, listeners, and turn your attention to the south, where space rocks are raining down from the sky. A beautiful, peaceful sight. Unless they're raining down on you, I'd imagine. Ah, oh, well, you win some, you lose some. In today's headlines, lottery winner Arthur Compass has announced winning the jackpot hasn't changed him one bit. He made this announcement floating over Krogenbusch in his new gold-plated hovercraft, just like he's always done. Thank you. 
Put your health in the hands of a quack. Come to Bungle Meditech, where advanced techniques and experimental treatments could make you live forever. Bungle Meditech. Other hospitals offer leeches. Ours will leave you speechless. 24 hours a day. This is Two Point Radio.
That delightful Jasmine Odyssey isn't just a pop singing sensation, she's also quite the humanitarian. Why, only this morning, she was visiting some of our local hospitals. She insisted on singing a song or two, even when the patients begged her not to. What an angel! Megan Pass has sent in a very thorough quote for today's nice words of the day. Remember that you are strong and blessed, that to live is to learn, and that all bad things happen for a reason, while good ones come to those who wait. That's a lot of nice words, Megan.
automated snack machines need restocking manually. And congratulations for joining me on this, the finest day of the year, the day of my birth. Needless to say, today's show will honor the man of the hour, the heartbeat of this county, and the crown jewel of Two Point Radio. Me, Sir Nigel Bickleworth. (laughs) 